In this video, I'm going to show you some tips that you could use to attempt to recover deleted Minecraft worlds on Bedrock. Now, I will warn you guys, working with Minecraft Bedrock in general is always just a hassle, and this is no exception. Now, what I recommend that you guys do first is actually check your Minecraft world file folder. Now, in order to access that, all you want to do is you want to go to your file explorer just like so. Then you want to go ahead and paste in this command right over here. And this is basically going to give us the location of our Minecraft Bedrock world folder. And over here where it does say username, you want to go ahead and delete that and put the name of your PC instead. I'm going to be leaving this command in the description down below where you guys can go ahead and copy and paste it. But just go ahead and delete where it says your username then go ahead and put in the name of your pc then you will now notice that a folder will appear and all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on open you will now notice that we will get a string of random letters right over here and numbers and symbols and stuff like that and those are actually your worlds so in order to identify your world name all you want to do is you want to go ahead and just click on a world then you want to go ahead and press on levelname.txt and this is basically going to give you the name of your Minecraft world. So this one is, uh, I think it was from one of my seed videos, the Giga Mushroom right over here. And if you guys want to see the world icon, then you guys could do so by just pressing on world icon just like so. And here it is. Now, guys, what you want to do from here is you want to go ahead and search your entire world's folder to see if the world that you are looking for is actually there. And if you do have a lot of worlds, then this process might be a little bit of a hassle. That's why I always say just working with Minecraft Bedrock in general is just so much trickier. I do wish that they just made this process easier. But, um, you know, unfortunately, that is just the way Minecraft Bedrock Edition is designed. So if you were able to go ahead and find the world that you were looking for, you need to make sure that it has the level.dat file right over here and also a DB folder just like this. And if it has both of these things, then you guys are actually able to go ahead and restore it. And basically what you would need to do is you need to go ahead and open up Minecraft and your folder should be there and your world should already be there. But once again, it will only work if you have the DB folder and the level.dat folder right over here. All right, but if that did not work for you, then what you would need to do is you need to go ahead and restore from device backups. Now, this will only work if you backed up your device or enabled cloud syncing. So you might be able to recover the world from a previous state. Now, yes, that does mean you may have lost progress. And again, it will only work if you did back up your device previously or you enabled cloud syncing whenever you actually started using your PC. So uh, what you need to do from here is you need to go ahead and just open up your settings. Once you're in settings, you want to go ahead and select on update and security. Then you want to go to the left menu and select on files backup. Now, if you did sync it to your cloud or something like that, or you did make a previous backup, then you should see something over here and you need to go ahead and just press on that. And then from there, you actually are able to go ahead and restore your Minecraft worlds just by looking for the actual world file, which I did show you guys how to do earlier. Once again, the command to do that will be found in the description down below. Or if you did back it up to like an external hard drive or something like that, then it will also appear on this list. And basically from there, you are able to go ahead and actually restore your Minecraft world. But if you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. See you later, French fries.